Good afternoon. More bad news for the New Mexico peanut plant that filed for bankruptcy this year following a nationwide salmonella scare. A lawsuit against the company filed by a chocolate maker claims they weren't honest with them or you. News 13's Emily Younger has a story. Another blow for Sunland Incorporated, the Portales-based peanut plant that filed for Chapter 7 bankruptcy just months ago. The company's peanut butter sold at Trader Joe's stores was linked to 41 salmonella cases in 20 states last year. Swain Creations, a California chocolate maker, used Sunland's peanut butter to make more than $1 million worth of chocolate. Swain sued the company earlier this year and is now going after Sunland CEO Jimmy Shearer. The gentleman who is the head of the company is contended to have had knowledge of, uh, or should have had knowledge about the product that he was permitting to be shipped. Tom Da, who is representing Swain in New Mexico, says Shearer failed to disclose health and safety violations. Swain claims Shearer knew about the health issues years before the FDA shut down the plant. Shearer's chocolates has sustained damages, as the complaint alleges out there, both to its reputation and to its business, and particularly in having to recall its product because of the adulterated According to a lawsuit filed in a California federal court, Swain says they had to recall all of that chocolate. The suit claims Sunlin and Shearer promised to pay them back for it, but never have. Emily Younger, KRQE News 13. Sunland's attorney did not want to comment on the lawsuit. Now, earlier this month, the bankruptcy judge did allow Sunland to temporarily open to deliver prepackaged products and sell off its assets. 